pastor that will not bow his knee to Baal. It's high time to awake. <laughs> the day draws nigh. There's been an acceleration of things happening since this coronavirus hit. Coronavirus is serious. I ain't afraid of it. I know my God and whom I serve. I know that there's already a day that I'm appointed to die. We can't sit back and be silent. We can't sit back and refuse to do what we know that God has called us to do. Go ahead and quote, quote uh, Romans 13 on me all day long. You got it wrong, a misinterpretation. We shall obey God and not man. When they say you can't speak in the name of Jesus and they try and censor what you're saying, it's time to disobey the government. What need of the Constitution do we have when our civil rights are not protected, huh? We don't need the Constitution and their government and their restrictions. You don't see what time it is? Bill Gates is an evil man. So are all the elite. What they've been doing in uh, third world countries and behind the scenes in our country that we don't know about. It's gonna, it's gonna happen. Things are ordained to happen as written in the, the word of God according to the will of God. Things will happen. But guess what? He never said stay in your house and shut up your mouth and keep back your voice and not speak the truth and what thus saith the Lord. He never said don't heal that sick person. Christians wearing masks and gloves. It shows you got some fear in you. Fear is not of God. He has not given us the spirit of fear. He's given us the spirit of love and of a sound mind. There's a lot of masons out here right now. I see them, you know, they got the emblem on their...